Creating a basic table in HTML. On my desktop, I have an HTM file called My Table. So I'll get that open in the editor first. I'll click it with my right mouse button and choose Edit with Notepad++. And I'll mention that is a uh, free uh, text editor utility that is great. It's um, a simple text editor, but it's also uh, pretty extensible and uh, really helpful for editing code because you um, you get the line numbers and it also recognizes uh, different sections so it's I highly recommend it okay so in this HTML file we basically have a uh, title tag and we have a little text in the body and not much more than that let's just get this uh, page going in the browser so we can see what we're doing so I'll say open with and I'll look at that page in my browser and we can see the title up here and we can see the uh, content that's in the uh, in the HTML file now great so what we'll do is create a very very simple table we'll go here to the body we'll get rid of this content and we'll start with our surprising table tag so an opening and closing table tag okay and in the table tag we need at least one row so we'll start with an opening and closing row tag. TR is the tag for table row. And then we'll need at least one column tag. So we'll do an opening and closing column tag, and that's a TD. So opening TD and close TD. That is a basic one row, one column table. I'll save the file, and then we'll go to our browser and take a look at it. And there's nothing there. And that's because there is no actual content yet. There's just the opening and closing tags that form the foundation of the table. Now if I were to put some content here and then go back to our browser, we'll see the word content. That's not too impressive. Uh, so what we'll do is we'll create a second column to actually give this table a little bit more of a uh, of a of a table foundation because right now it's really just holding one one cell of of uh, content which doesn't really do much for us. So what I'll do is I'll just go down here and I'll copy the uh, column tags and I'll create another one and I'll make this one left column and I'll make this one the right column and then we'll go back to our browser and we'll take a look and now we've got left column right column and it's looking pretty good if we wanted to uh, create more rows actually it's pretty simple we can just take what we've done and we can copy it and we can paste it down here go back to the browser take a look now we've got a two column and two row table so once again just to back things up a little bit uh, everything of course, since it's content, will go between the opening and closing body tags. So we have an opening and closing table tag. And then we have our first row, the opening and closing row tags. And within that row, we have two columns, opening and closing left column, opening and closing right column. And then we have the exact same thing repeated again. We have a second row with a left column and then a right column. Uh, table tags defines a table, TR tags define the rows, and TD tags define the columns. Every table has to have at least one row and one column. You can actually have a table with one row and one column, but it is more common that you'll find a table with at least one row and at least two columns, um, because then you actually have a table. But that's simply up to you. So there you have it. That is creating a simple table in an HTML file.